Hello all you Teslonians, welcome back to another video here in the Tesla Sheeps channel. Uh, today uh, we are going to be looking at some drinks, not really. Uh, <laughs> no, um, don't don't judge me. Um, I only, well, I only got this today. It's a big ass freaking uh, Starbucks drink. Um, if you get one, you get the other one free, so. Whenever something is free, just go for it. Don't even ask the second question, in my opinion. But anyway, uh, today I want to talk to you all about what to, what, like if you, if you just bought a new Tesla, if you just got delivery of the new Tesla, your brand new Tesla that you've been waiting for a long time, most probably a Model Y or Model 3, um, what would I recommend you do to your car right away? Um, don't even wait for it. Um, I made this mistake uh, myself by, you know, when, when I got my first ever car. So I have no experience in cars at all. Uh, this is my first ever car. I made a lot of mistakes. Uh, so let me take you through each and every one and uh, tell you how to fix it. So let's get right in. Sorry about the wind, but let's get started. Um, so the first thing that I would highly recommend you keeping in your car while well, getting for your Tesla is some floor mats. I got these from a good friend uh, that I met at Supercharger, really nice. Um, I've used these for the summertime, but I do have wintertime mats uh, that I got from Tesla before I even got the car. So you should definitely, definitely have those. And then the second thing that I would recommend uh, having is a microfiber cloth in your center console so these are really really comes in handy when you need to you know quick wipe uh, down your screen or quickly wipe down the front area right here dust builds up builds up pretty quickly so it's really nice to have a microfiber cloth in your center console including some wet wipes so highly recommend you having those and then the second thing that I would highly, highly recommend you having um, is some wraps. So let me go around and tell you which part to wrap up if you don't have enough money to wrap the whole car. Um, main thing, mainly the front hood area, as you can see, there's some deep scratches right here and some rock chips here and there. The front is just littered with rock chips from highways. So I would highly recommend you wrapping up this part over here and the front fender. If you have money, you can also wrap up the side fenders and wrap up the whole hood area. And also wrap this part. It's really, really important because rock chips kind of, you know, it's kind of flares out this way, so they do hit it. So I highly recommend you wrapping that and also Get a mud flap for the front area if you do. Uh, not a lot of you know rock ship goes to that. So that I got it from Tesla for free uh, because I'm a Canadian. They gave it to all Canadian um, because of the winter weather and salt smush that all over gets in there. So that's a really nice thing to do. Um, really nice of Tesla to provide those for free. But another thing that I would highly recommend you wrapping is this door seal right here so as you can see it got some scratches because you know people when you get passengers in your car um, they get really really you know excited about the car they forget you know where to step and stuff so it's kind of you know they move the seat forward and they don't realize that their leg is long so they kind of you know scratch the side um, so don't blame your passengers just wrap it up so you don't need to worry about that also wrap up this part over here as you can see a lot of scratches and the glove box important um if you have lady friends i mean they're gonna have their handbags and when that whenever you know they're taking it out and then they you know tend to scratch uh so i would highly recommend you wrapping this part with clear wrap and also the center console i mean center console man I should have done this long ago, but I waited for like months to wrap it. But I would highly recommend you wrapping, like doing all this thing right when you get your Tesla. Don't even wait for like a month. Do it within a week. Um, this center console wrap is really important because the black piano black is really nice. But this, that thing, like you look at it and it gets scratched. Uh, the next day it will get scratched. So I would highly recommend you, you know, wrapping that center uh, console area. And then the other thing that I would 
highly recommend you doing uh, or keeping in your car uh, for that matter is a smart thermometer so this one i already did a video on so go check that out i'll leave a link uh, down below so this is really useful for your front trunk if you're about to keep some you know food that you just bought or some drinks or any cold item uh, because it's canada we get winter like no other so i would like to keep you know cold drinks in the front trunk but at the same time you don't want to keep your pop or any carbonated drink uh, in extreme cold weather it will literally pop so you don't want to do that so it's a good thing to have a thermometer so you can always monitor uh the temperature of the front trunk so it won't pop or you know it won't get frozen over or something um this is bluetooth 5.0 so i'll leave a link down below i mean i'll for my other video that i did so go check that out the one more thing in the front trunk that i would highly recommend you keeping is one of these so i do I know that Tesla, you know, gives you one of these uh, J1772 adapter when you get your Model 3 or any Tesla for that matter for free. But I would highly recommend you getting one of these, uh, another one, just in case and keep it in the front trunk or anywhere but in your car. It's really, really important that you do because some J1772 uh, uh, cables, like the, the, the charge port, is damaged so if you do if you're about to you know plug it in it will literally melt down the interior plugs and then you need to replace the whole plug because it won't you know go in i already did a video on this if you want go check that out so i would highly recommend you getting one of these because right when you are about to go for a trip you will realize hey it's not working what the hell so to save you from all that trouble look at one of those um it's 60 something dollars canadian um i know it's expensive but getting a spare one of those is really really important and i highly recommend you getting one of those sorry for the wind um uh, but yeah tesla will replace it for free um you know they're they're sometimes really nice and they just replace it but again for emergencies you i re highly recommend you having one of those and then the other thing that i would recommend you having in the car is this so this is my creation so it's basically a piece of i think it's a what is it is it a cherry wood or i don't know what wood it is so it's a piece of wood that i carved a little indent in and i usually just put on some oil um it's uh, it's not really an oil it's like a scent that i put it like a couple of drops in uh in there uh like usually like four drops is pretty good and just leave it in the front area right here and it just sits there uh because there's a uh bandana uh a fabric wrapped around the center uh it it never like moves around it just stick there um, and you know releases that oil uh, that scent slow by little by little and you know freshen up the uh, interior you don't need to hang any anything from this this area it's really really not good uh, you don't need to buy those expensive uh, scent um, thing that you put in the front uh, area right here piece of wood free you just need to buy that it's like $15 for that little bottle lasts for about like I don't know eight months um, if you use it like if you if you're if you use it every single day like really heavily probably like six months it will last this one I had it for I think eight months I think yeah and I still have like another good three months to go so like basically a year worth of that it's only $15 so highly recommend you getting one of those and another thing that I would highly 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 recommend you getting these is a tire um, air filler um, and um, you know you can also um, air up your tire uh, so this one I one of my friend gave it to me uh, but Tesla do sell them uh, there on the online store so get one of these it connects to your 12 volt outlet in the front and just you know you can air up your tires whenever you want to and if there's an emergency and you got to go somewhere really quick but you got a puncher you don't want to wait for a tesla to come and fix it you can just you know fill it up and uh 
it's not driving. It has a, a foam filler, I think, some type of filler. But anyway, another thing that I would keep in my car, which I realized since the you know since I got the car, is some you know bottles, a bottle of wax, a bottle of uh, car cleaner, and a bottle of Windex with some microfiber cloth. Why is that? Well, if you are going. If, if you're just driving around in like a countryside or even any road for that matter um, you'll get bugs in the front no matter what um, so having some of those is really really useful so you can just wipe the bugs from your front hood uh, because bugs and paint they're not good it will damage the paint uh, if you keep the bugs there for a long period of time so again really really useful to have so door seal wrap um, you, if, you, if you have enough money you can wrap all the for all four door seals again you can get it for you know on Amazon probably like a good 2 by 15 2 by 10 foot uh, clear wrap and you can wrap the door seals uh, the um, this area right here and the glove box so really really and highly recommend recommend it that you have these things before you even get your Tesla because these are cosmetic damages uh, that you don't want it to ha happen to your you know baby Tesla you just got you know it, it hurts when you uh, see your Tesla get hurt um, so those things are really really important another thing that I've seen people do is wrapping their front uh, screen I mean it's 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 not it's not needed to be honest um, this is not a screen that, that you're gonna put in your pocket this is not the screen that you're gonna take it around with you uh, anytime at all um, for example if you you don't need to wrap this why well you have your laptop right did you have you ever wrapped your laptop screen um, have you ever put a screen protector for your laptop screen no uh, because it you're not gonna touch your screen that often um, this one yeah you do touch your screen but I've had this car for a year and a half more than a year and a half and there are no scratches or even small uh, markings whatsoever uh, but again if you really really want to baby your car go ahead put on the uh, screen protector. I don't want to spend that money to put on a screen protector uh, that I really don't need, so I didn't do it. Another thing that I forgot to mention is center cam. Um, if you don't have uh, a USB stick, go get it right away. A 64 gig would, should be fine. And format it to Tesla thing and hook it up. Really important that you have a center cam. So yeah, those are the things that I would highly recommend you doing into your car right when you get it don't wait a month or two because i did and it's man it's uh i really think you know if, if i could go back uh in time uh to when i got the delivery of this car i would have done all those things um and you know prevented from those cosmetic damages uh that done to me it's not big but still it hurts uh so yeah if you just gotten your new tesla uh congratulations first of all um, if you use my referral code, I'm even beyond happy. Uh, so go use, uh, go like just right away, wrap these things so it won't get damaged. Uh, don't wait more than a week. Uh, so front hood area, really important. The um, glove box and the door sills, really, really important. So go wrap those things. And man, Tesla stocks. Um, this is a really weird jump from talking about tesla cars to tesla stocks but have you all seen the tesla stock recently two thousand dollars a share mind blown i'm happy to have uh, some shares in tesla it's not much but um it is a lot to me because one share just reached two thousand dollars and they're gonna split the share soon uh, before the end of the month i think uh into four so can't wait for that so congratulations tesla and uh, if you're new to the channel uh please click that subscribe button and all those new people that are subscribed to my channel welcome and congratulations you are 
a Tesla sheep now. And um, use my referral code if you wanna, if you're getting a Model 3 or a Model Y. Um, it's really useful. You get 1,500 kilometers of supercharging. Uh, and I also get that 1,500 kilometers of supercharging, which is good for both of us. So I'll leave that linked down below. Um, and uh, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up um, and uh, let's get this channel to 420 subscribers. If you know what I mean, you're a Tesla sheep. So if you don't know, subscribe to this channel so you will know soon. Uh, but anyway, uh, this is it for today's video. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, this is me, Mithrishan, signing out.